Alrighty, welcome everyone. I'm Tiabu, and I am here for Kaguya-sama Love is War, Episode 9. Last time on Kaguya-sama, regular Kaguya goodness. We had the, the Ishigami exam thing, and the general Shirogane versus Kaguya exam thing. And then we had the other Shirogane uh, introduced, for real, the sister. And she has similar tastes, romantic tastes, to her brother, which is kind of cool and kind of interesting. And we'll see how... I just bumped the mic. Editing me! Fix that, please. Um, We'll see how, if at all, that plays out. I don't know. Yeah, I got nothing. All right, let's 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 get to the next episode. Multiple versions. Bit shooting Mega with the picture-in-picture -picture links in the description. And uh, timer-based version with any discussion that I do on YouTube, as usual. Beep beep timer. You should know the drill by now. Timer goes here. Fast intro. Nice. This is T, by the way. Oh. Real stormy. Okay. <laughs> the what? We'll do what? Yes, it does. Okay. Uh... God Thunder <laughs> Belly Button Okay, gonna look that up at the end. Kagi gonna give you a ride? Yep. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Can't do that. The colored rain. <laughs> So that's a no-go. <laughs> Don't be mean to Chica. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah, but he's not going to bring it up for the same reason. Mm-hmm. Ha <laughs> 
Let's get you out of here before you ruin my plans. Not so much a game as it is war. Where's Ishigami? <laughs> That's cruel. Mm hmm. To a member of society. <laughs> I like that cut. With camera movement, with an ease out, and then the turn. That was cool. We'll see. Oh, crap. <laughs> he left his phone? Rechargeable battery is dead. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is so evil. Why the hairdryer? <laughs> Very hard though. <laughs> nah. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's so evil. He can't even call a taxi. <laughs> Shit. Yes. <laughs> I've heard that before. Song at seven twenty ish. I know I've heard that before. I don't think it's part of the OST. It's going to drive me nuts. Karma. <laughs> Got a new battery. Okay. Chica wants to pay a visit. Okay, okay. Ah. Uh, he's going to think it's super cute. Yep. Yep. Who would want to do that?
<risa> ok. Three way rock, rock, paper, scissors. Okay. So she's already cheated. Mars cards? <laughs> Marked cards. Yep, so minus five points, but she could still win. But if everybody knows that the cards are marked, then there's no advantage. Okay, different different cards? Yeah. Crap. <laughs> Evil Chica. She was waiting for you. Nah, Is it a trap? She put the other card down. <laughs> when was that cut? Thirteen. Twenty? Death note. Ah. Huh? Oh. Ah. Huh?
Shame, 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 shame. <laughs> okay just utter failure okay Get to see how the other half lives. What's up? Of course. Oh, wait, she's... That's a different one. Is that a different one? Okay, no, it's it's just her. Yeah. <laughs> About Kaguya Shinomiya. Right. She got a fever. <laughs> what? Yeah. Break. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Definitely. So why why was Hisaka pretending to be someone else? This is all a plan by Kaguya, isn't it? No. <laughs>
Hanabi? <laughs> Wow. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Hey. Been a while. I feel like you've fallen into a trap. <laughs> And she's up. And her eyes are normal. Something like that. Why is the president in my bed? <laughs> okay, it wasn't a plan. Okay. Okay. Pretty cool episode. Uh, interesting to see a number of, of skits that really are just one skit and all lead into each other. Um, I think some people commented saying that there might be some more of that incoming and that the, uh, the three skits per episode formula might, might break down a bit. Um, I like it. Honestly, I, I quite like it. We've built up the characters enough that we can do slightly more complex stories with them. And I, as I said, I, I like it. He's good. So there were there were a couple of things in this episode that that caught my attention in particular. The first one was the song that plays when uh, when Shirogane does a bike drive by, and.
I've heard that, and I've heard it recently. Does anybody recognize that? Because it's gonna, it's gonna kill me. It's gonna kill me until I figure out what that song was. I know it! Damn it, does it... Please, if anybody recognizes that, please let me know, because I want to know. And if it's nothing, then I'm going crazy. So I I need I need to know it's it's from something it's like it's from something Damn it okay 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 regardless uh so that's a thing and I if you, if you know please tell me please tell me um and then at 1320ish yeah this cut That cut right there. I don't know if it's intentional, but that reminds me more than anything of the scene of of Light writing like a badass, like way melodramatic in uh, in Death Note. Of course, I don't know if it's intentional. That scene is is shot from like directly behind Light uh, and down slightly compared to this, whereas we're off to the off to the right and up. But it's the same sort of motion. It's. It's probably not intended. It's just making this look over the top and cool, which is great. Um, I don't get what the hairdryer was for in the, the battery swap, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, I love the, the colored rain here. It actually reminds me a lot of the Sangatsu no Lion OP of, of all things. The season two OP one. Yeah. Um <laughs> Ah, this this whole scene with the hairdryer and the phone switching out and following Shiragane's footsteps with the big booms. Yeah. Uh and her treating it like it's like a a quest mission. It's great. Sick Kaguya. Chika wants to go. Ishigami does not really want to go. Shiragane definitely wants to go. Okay. It's a really simple, solid setup. And then we, we play games. Play lots of games. Chika's a dirty, dirty cheater. Um, I actually, I really like this particular face because it's, um, it's a modification on, on Chika's design, like especially in the eyes. Uh, and it works to make her seem serious you know normally her eyes are very big and round and here they're they're angled a lot more like kaguya's and shiragane's when they get serious about stuff uh and i think the shape of her face is slightly different too maybe not it's about the same in any case i, I like it i like it a lot shiragane blames himself I don't understand this clock thing, but that's okay. I think I get get the point. Chika was cheating by arranging the cards in a certain manner. Why is Hayasaka disguising herself? I think her name is Hayasaka, right? The maid character. Why is she disguising herself? Is her relationship with uh, Kaguya a secret? Is it because Shiragane would recognize her as another student at the school? She's just doing this for fun? At first I thought, oh, this is all a big ploy by Kaguya. But it's not because she's out of her out of her skull. Why the color contacts and the padded bust and stuff? I don't know. Then we see we see the bottom of this um I don't know, print, family motto thing, and it's later revealed what it says. Which was kinda cool, and I want to see what it said again. And she goes into this like super over explanation of she's just really sick and in a fever dream. And it's like, <laughs> everything's set up. Nobody can hear you. Nobody can see you. Don't do anything bad. <laughs> uh-huh. 
Okay, here we go. Do not rely on anyone. Instead, use them. Do not receive anything. Instead, steal. Do not love anyone. There is no instead. Just like, no love for you. <laughs> oh, jeez. It's a hell of a family code thing. Uh, then Kakia has, like, grown three cup sizes when we get these side boob shots. There. Like, she's pretty flat. Where did the boobage come from? I'm not complaining or anything, it's just like, where did it come from? I don't know. And she's checking the sheets to ensure that, that nothing untoward happened. Okay. Pretty cute episode. I Again, I like that there are these sketches that sort of run together and form one sort of semi-cohesive story. I like that. I do hope we get to see more of that. Although I also really enjoyed the, the short sketch comedy stuff. This was a little bit, I, I don't know, I, I wouldn't call it more serious, but it was more slice of lifey. Which is fine. As I said it, before, like we've built up the characters enough that we can do sort of slice of lifey stories and just rely on their character traits interacting. Pretty cool. Is there anything else that was really stand out? I don't think so. I think I've covered everything that I want to talk about for this episode. Um, if you do recognize that song at about 720 uh, when Shirogane is biking, please do let me know because I would love to find it. It's got this like... Ah, I, uh, I want to say it's... it's. Mm, if I had to start looking for it, just like going through songs, I would look at the initial D soundtrack. Uh, does that make sense? I don't think it's from that, but that's where I would start looking. Damn. Anyway, if you if you know what that song is, please let me know. Uh, let's let's do shell stuff real quick. If you liked the video, go ahead and do that. If you hated it, give it a thumbs down. It's all good. If you could leave me a comment letting me know what you disliked about it, then I can improve, and that's really good and helpful. Uh, if you're not subbed and you want more, maybe do that. And if you are subbed and you're not getting my videos, maybe the bell can help you. And as as always, if you really like this content, you can head over to patreon.com slash tiaboo to support this guy and uh, get early access to a bunch of my stuff and ability to vote in polls and other goodies. So check that out if you want to. In any case, I've been Tiaboo. This has been Kaguya-sama episode 9. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Peace.